Hi, welcome to Multi Android Zone for the last episode of how to create WhatsApp like chat application in Android part 3. Number 5 is user profile customizations. Hope all of you know about user profile customizations. Here is a screenshot of menu that open up when the user tries to edit this profile. When the user is trying to add a new status or modify his existing status, then add status activity dot java is called and here you see edit text et status. This method creates the new text view for adding status and calls. Further, the db adapter dot java is used to insert a new status and updates it into the database as well as the preference are in the shared storage on the user profile. User image customizations. The user image can be changed in the similar way new image is choose during the registration. In create new group activator java we will see how a group is created and other happened when a message is sent to the groups. Options for creating new group is selected take as towards go to next method. Intent options starts a new activity within the fragment known as selected group user list dot java and also load the image and the name. Number six is core functionality. Core functionality deals with the settings panels where user gets the customized his preference and settings as part of his choice and the core functionality modules with the applications. The top five options available in this functionality is Delete account settings, inviting friends, notifications, and change number, and last one is the help. And upon setting these options, the op appropriate activities are launched. For example, the change number options, the appropriate activities are launched. The other core functionalities. Other than the above mentioned activities, there are a few other things that play a major role in this application service are generally the small parts in these applications where they establish connectivity within the system between the phone systems between the and server. Application has many service like this connect update service, download file service, GCM intent service, update last screen service, video upload service and others. Models are used to establish a standard and initialize data that are for frequently used in the application. Country code dot Java. This is country code dot Java. Group details model dot Java. Message model dot Java. Name no model dot Java. And user details dot Java. And emojis adapter dot Java. This activity in the emoji sections is used to adapt the emojis from the database and display it in the screen. The other important activities on emojis are emojis icon, edit text, grid fragments, spawns as and handles which are nothing but the specifications of the how emojis should be displayed. And here is the resource folder is animations. Animations folder holds the details and depth of the animations of this application. In this apps, it contains sliding menu library. Menu folder, it consists nothing but the collection of details to be displayed within the apps for user interface, sick lock, sick OK and cancel. Raw folder, it is the place where the things like audio, video, JSON library. Raw folder is the place where the things like audio, video and JSON file located and values folder is collections of the text to be used to displaying the applications. Two types of chat application involved in, in the process of these apps. First was the administrator view where the admin of these apps can view it from server. This application uses code originator for its PHP plus database development parts. Number seven is layout. Layout of the front end developments. The user interface of these apps can be customized using this layout. Some of the layouts in these applications it is activity add status is for adding new status activity chat for chatting with new user activity create new group this layout for creating a new group activity group details is displays the details of this group and activity recent chat list this one is for recent chat list and the last one is the admin panel 
every app should have a certain time when the app goes to the database and fetches or upload data into it. Here let us look at now. This is the server code and the database. Though here database.php will contains the settings need to access your database. Autoload.php is used to the file specified which system should be loaded by default. Routes.php this files lets you remap URI request to the specific controller functions and user agents.php this files contains four arrays of user agents data. You can add a new admin panel to these applications also. So if you want to buy the source code of these applications, contact with me. So subscribe to Multi Android Zone for more exciting tutorials and apps on Androids. Bye bye.